habari za mchana eh uh, here ya miaka mpya 2020 uh, hope all goes well i hope we see each other um, strong as you are thank you very much for gracing us with your presence today as we heard from uh, haji manara that uh, the the reason why we've called for today's press conference number 1 is to provide information about the readiness of Simba Sports Club for the match over the weekend. Secondly, to provide information around ticketing. Thirdly, to ensure that we um, ask our supporters, fans and members to support Simba on the 4th of uh, January when we play in this uh, big derby uh, in East African uh, continent. If I may take uh, this opportunity and say I'm very excited, I'm looking forward to, to this derby. Um, I think the preparation has been good so far. A number of things have happened, if you recall, as a media, that uh, we've recently changed the, the head coach. We brought in a new coach. Uh, we have recently uh, managed to get few players back onto the pitch. Uh, though I won't dwell too much on the technical things and players, that is not my, my responsibility, that is coach responsibility, but for information it's important for you to note that, uh, for instance, uh, we had uh, a very long injury that Boko had, so I'm excited to have seen him play 90 minutes yesterday. It says that uh, whatever we are putting together with uh, the doctors and the technical team, it's working out. Uh, the team for the past three, four matches has not been uh, the same team in terms of who plays. But if you look closely, you'll realize that the coach has done very well to ensure that everybody, every player has got an opportunity to play. So that when he makes his assessments going forward, he's very clear who he should keep, who he should not keep, how to deal with certain players in terms of development and coaching and also and so, and so forth and so forth going forward. So I'm very excited that uh, things have been going on according to our plans. I know that uh, uh, the 4th of uh, January is a big day. Make no mistake, it's one of the biggest um, uh, for, 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 for Simba. You must bear in mind that uh, we are heading into the new century. You know, we from the the 2019 was the end of the previous century. So we start on the new century. 2020, we start with the younger. So that is big for the Tanzanian football. That is big for the Premier League board. Um, hopefully, we will have a number of uh, links into this match on Saturday. So as a club, we are ready. Uh, we are here to tell you that uh, we are ready as a club. We are here to tell you uh, that uh, we are ready in terms of logistics. We are ready in terms of uh, 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 the team itself. You know, if I may, I may recall, maybe on top of my head, that uh, one of the issues as well I needed to report was that uh, uh, on the players, we have uh, Wilker De Silva, our striker, who is currently not uh, with the team. He's travelled to, to Malaysia for a possible uh, transfer into a Malaysian uh, a team. And the reasons are very clear that uh, uh, Wilker is really tried his best, very good player, but he found it a bit difficult to acclimatize in, the, uh, uh, in Tanzania. You know, he's a very good player. So we are looking at ways to assist each other to ensure that he keeps on with his career and then we can all move forward. So we wish him all the best. He's been away for two days now and very soon we'll make announcements in terms of if he was successful with uh, uh, his transfer to the Malaysian club. I know that there's a lot of questions around uh, registrations. Let me say that uh, registrations are not something that we do because our fans say that we must go and sign or because some fundies in certain corner decides that we need a certain player. When we recruit, we involve everybody involved uh, in running of this club. We involve the technical team, we involve our technical committee, we involve a number of people before we can make a decision on signing uh, uh, players. So I can assure you now that after you've made a decision whether you need to re reinforce the team or you need to bring in other players, it's also a process to go and get a player into 
uh, at the club. For instance, I hear that somebody has been signed by some club, but now he cannot move because a clearance must come from here, this must come from there. So all these things, before you, you, you I can come in front of you and say, now we've got Haji Manara as our uh, goalkeeper, I must make sure that all these small nitty-gritties, contractual obligations, the international transfers, regulations, uh, any other pending matters are taken care of. So sometimes we don't delay with announcements because we want to, but we want to ensure that behind the scenes we've covered all the bases to ensure that tomorrow we don't have uh, issues that we cannot play players because now there's a dispute, now there's this. So we've been in a process, we've been working very, very hard. I know that uh, there's a lot of uh, rumors around the player from uh, Mozambique, but that's not the only player that we've been looking at. There's other two players that we've been uh, chasing. You know, So we are hopeful that uh, before the end of the week, we'll be able to make pronouncements to you to say, these are the players who've signed, now we confirm, we can introduce them to you. You will recall when we uh, introduced the coach. We introduced the coach very late in the evening, around 9, I think, or 9.30. There's one reason why we needed to sort out the issues of the contract, agree on the terms, and sign on the dotted line. You can't just uh, uh, announce if you have not done those uh, particular steps. So. For the comfort of our supporters, for the comfort of uh, uh, the lovers of Simba uh, uh, Sports Club, please note that there's a lot of work behind the scenes. We need to tie in all the loose ends before we can make uh, any uh, uh, announcements. So I hope the question um, of any recruitment or registration is covered by that. I hope you understand the process that we undertake. And I want to emphasize, you know, um, even the, 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 the chairman of the board uh, had said in the last AGM that uh, Simba is moving on a positive trajectory. Everything that we are doing now, we're doing it long term. We must think, not now, you know, I know some of the uh, fans, uh, uh, Haji, they say, no, but we must register now, we must play. Uh, we register, we must play against Yanga, you know. It's not how things are done. We must respect the coach and his technical team. They are the ones who are play, working with the players. They will decide how things are done. If they feel that if I've signed Mbaga today and Mbaga must play tomorrow, it's their prerogative. We should respect their uh, decisions and we support them in any way possible to ensure that their job becomes easy. So in terms of players, I think that is the, 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 uh, the, uh, the brief. Also, there was a... a a clip that was making rounds that uh, Manjinji or some Madanda team, first division, they've signed. Uh, Maj -maj. Uh, Maj -maj. Uh, they've signed uh, uh, Rashid Juma. Uh, Rashid Juma. You know, there's no truth in that. You know, Rashid Juma is injured. He's recovering from uh, a, 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 a minor fracture, um, but he's working very well with our doctors, with Adele and uh, and, and, and uh, Paulo. And, and Dr. Gembe, they are doing very well with the team, you know, the boy, he will be ready very soon. Uh, uh, Atuman, Mirage. Mirage as well, uh, he's also had some uh, minor knocks, but he's coming on uh, very well. You saw Boko yesterday, you know, you can see he has not played for some time, but we are happy that he's back on the pitch again. So. That's where we are in terms of, of, of players, that's where we are in terms of our technical bench. Um, the rest of the arrangements, really, they are on track. And I just want to mention that uh, we respect the match that we are going to play on Saturday. Mm -hmm. We respect young Africans as our rivalries. Uh, we are looking forward to a good uh, day. Uh, we are looking forward to a good match where the fight will be in the pitch, where 90 minutes will be important for both teams. We as Simba, we are prepared. We keep on preparing. Um, I am sure that, because uh, I spoke to the coach last night, you know, we always have a briefing sessions, you know. Um, you know, it's very important for the management and the technical team to be working in, 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 in coherent. So it's been going very well. The feedback has been good. There's a lot of concerns, like, like any other team. You know, you go and win five, there will be concerns to say, but you should have scored 10. You go and win one, they will be concerned to say, but why didn't you win two? So 
there will always be an engagement on how we improve as a club going forward. You know, so and I'm sure that uh, with the assistance on Matola and the and the rest of the guys, they will be able to bring us the best team on on Saturday when we face younger. I think uh, from the side of the management, that's where we are. Uh, we've got Abbas here. Abbas is in charge of the logistics of the team, the camp, and all those things. So we had a briefing meeting this morning as well. So he's briefed me that everything is in order. We uh, in camp. And also, uh, Haji, there's a, 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 um, a tradition that uh, the team will camp maybe away in Zanzibar and come and play matches here. Uh, but, you know, we've been very fortunate as Simba. We've got a very beautiful camping uh, facility uh, in Bunju. We've built a, a nice training venue uh, 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 at Bunju as well, the, the most Simba Arena. So we've got facilities for, for us to prepare better for these matches. So we are happy that the boys will go back to camp today. After they've been given an off day yesterday, after the match, the players were afforded an opportunity to go and meet their families and do whatever they need to do to the end of the year. But we're training this afternoon, everybody will be back, and we are back uh, in camp this afternoon. So. I would like uh, to end it there. If there's any questions, obviously we'll take uh, uh, after this. I would like to give uh, Hashim just a minute just to talk on the, on the, on the members and fans, how prepared they are, and um, how they're going to ensure that the club is uh, supported on Saturday. Asante.